I do have a really nice engineering sample part kit I want to share with you guys. The materials are really important when it comes to engineering and 3D printing. And these are all the stuff that came inside engineering materials package from Formlabs. This is durable resin gear assembly. All the parts are 3D printed and plugged in later on. And it's pretty nice. Anything robotics can benefit from this. G-Tanky, it feels really different when you touch it. It's glass filled. This is a thermofoaming mold that's 3D printed again with resin. Next up, what we have is ESD resin probe holder. This is a cost effective solution for creating static dissipative parts. This is really good while working with critical electrical components. Next up is high temperature resin. This is a nozzle and high temperature resins can go, especially this one, can go up to 235 Celsius degree at 0.45 megapascals. Whole section is here, so it pulls in from there and gets out from the other side. Next up is the draft resin. This gives you very fast printability, four times faster. If you need to do something really quick and dirty, draft resin is your friend. This is another one, multifluidic model. When you put the fluids from there, you can get different channels and mixtures and every kind. Clear resin is my most used resin, especially when it comes to something that I'm molding. This is another favorite thing of mine. Um, it's flexible resin, 80A. Look at it, it's just like very cool. It's a little bit sticky feeling. That's what I don't like, but for flexible applications, these are pretty nice. Last but not least is a tough resin. This this is a spring system. As you can see, you can go all the way down and up. If you need to make suspensions or anything springy with 3D printed, tough resin is your friend. Still not broken. Cool. Which resin would you use in your STEM project? Comment down below.